Hi, my name is Nancy. Every year in the United States, there are more than 100,000 children in foster care waiting to be adopted. Each year, our country focuses attention on this important issue by declaring November to be National Adoption Month. Stark County Children's Services celebrates National Adoption Month with an amazing portrait gallery featuring area kids. We call our display the Stark County Heart Gallery. If you were watching last year's Heart Gallery, you might remember me. I hosted the video and was one of the featured kids looking for my forever home. I am really happy to be back to take you on this year's Heart Gallery tour. So let's get started. 14-year-old Tyler is a 7th grader who enjoys playing basketball, football, and catch with his friends. He loves to tell jokes and make people laugh. Tyler says family is made up of people who love you and the perfect family includes people who are kind and fun. Artist Heather Bullock created Tyler's portrait. Heather says that foster kids go through so much that it is a blessing to be able to paint portraits for them. She also loves the reaction from the kids when they see their portraits. Cheyenne is 16. She has an amazing smile that lights up her face and she loves to laugh. Cheyenne isn't able to speak, so she communicates with her smile and her eyes. People who know Cheyenne say she has a sense of humor and she lets you know what she is thinking. Cheyenne enjoys music, company, and having someone read to her. She works very hard to complete her educational goals. Cheyenne has ongoing medical issues and needs an adoptive family who is able to care for her. Rita Woodruff is the artist who created Cheyenne's portrait. Rita says her artistic talent is a gift from God given to her to help others. She says if she can help one child to be noticed and adopted or helped in any way, she is doing exactly what God intended for her. This is John. He's 17 and a high school junior who likes math. John is fun-loving, outgoing, and loves to talk. He is thoughtful and considerate and enjoys helping others. John really enjoys singing, dancing, karate, and watching WWE wrestling. John says he would like to have a forever family who loves and takes care of him. The artist who created John's portrait is Tim Carmony. Tim says it is an honor to be involved in the Heart Gallery. He participates because he knows how important it is for kids to have a family. Tim enjoys getting to know the Heart Gallery kids, rooting for them when they find their forever family, and celebrating when they do. This is Dante. He is six and his life has been very different than most of ours. He has a lot of challenges, but Dante also has a heartwarming smile and he is happy and content. Dante loves the sounds of caring voices and to be held and cuddled. Dante loves to be taken for walks and to basketball games and musicals. He likes going to school and being around other children. Dante joyfully responds to attention and love. Dante needs a forever family that is strong, resourceful, patient, and understanding so that they can take care of his needs. Artist Lynn Digby created Dante's portrait. Lynn enjoys participating in the Heart Gallery because it is such a wonderful way of using art to bring awareness to the need for adoptive families. She believes that art should be shown for its own sake to celebrate the kids who are looking for a home. 15-year-old twins, Michaela and Mercedes, are ninth graders who are lots of fun and very engaging. They are very close and laughingly explain it's a twin thing. They love animals, talking, swimming, and playing games on their tablets. They also enjoy movies, karaoke, and dancing. Michaela and Mercedes are very excited about being adopted and staying with their forever families. Artist Christine Benner created the twins portrait. She loves participating in the Heart Gallery because it is so wonderful to meet the Heart Gallery children. She says knowing she can help them find forever homes makes her heart smile. And here's the final portrait. Sam is 18 and a senior in high school. He is a real hot sauce fan with a great sense of humor. Sam is laid back and charming. He loves playing video games, watching videos, and playing with the family dog. Sam is active in his church, enjoys meeting people, and thinks he might like to learn how to cook. Artist Tim Eakin created the portrait of Sam. Tim says he enjoys making gifts for others because of the time and thought involved. He says when you spend hours creating a gift for someone, your thoughts are with that person. 
Tim says his portraits let kids know he cares about them and their happiness. That concludes the 2017 Heart Gallery Tour. Did you notice that there isn't a painting of me this year? I am really happy to tell you that I am not in this year's Heart Gallery for a very, very good reason. I have been adopted, and being adopted is very exciting, a little scary, and very emotional. And now, I have my forever family with my mom, dad, brothers, three cats, two dogs, and a kitten that I got for my birthday named Toulouse. Here's a picture of me with my family. We have so much fun together and I am so grateful that we found each other. My prayers have been answered and every day I am thankful to have a loving family. I'd like for you to meet my mom and here she is. Hi everybody, I am Nancy's mom. Her father and I knew we wanted to adopt for a long time. We started out with a dream to expand our family and fulfill our lives with someone else to love. That dream soon changed to a mission. After attending training and learning of the thousands of Ohio children in care and examples of what many of them had been through, we now had a new purpose for our lives. Innocent children needed us. We could not stand by and do nothing. Many people want to do something that matters with their lives. Some examples are donating blood and volunteering at a local food bank. And while these acts are admirable, offering a forever family to a foster child will make a difference to that child and to you every single day for the rest of your lives. While you are offering help to another, offering love, a home, and the priceless feeling of security, you receive so much more. Perhaps you think you can't afford it. Well, we all can. It's free. Perhaps you don't know if you're the right family. Picture perfect like the Waltons. Well, no family is perfect, and yet if you have love in your heart, you could be the one for the job. Nancy is a wonderful addition to our family, and I look forward to all the memories we will make together. Don't hesitate. Contact Star County Job and Family Services today and begin the journey to better your life and the life of a child. If you would like to learn more about all the amazing kids looking for forever homes, or if you would like to learn more about fostering and adoption, check out the Stark County Job and Family Services website or call Children's Services and talk to a worker who will gladly answer all of your questions. And if you would like to learn more about this year's caring artists, you can read about them on the Stark County Job and Family Services website. Thanks for joining me for the 2017 Heart Gallery Tour. And please, invite your friends to watch. Remember, every child deserves a forever family. Bye for now.